Welcome to another Battle Bitch tutorial. I'm Phoebe, I'm from State 288, and it has been a while. Uh, I haven't had much new things to discuss, but I just learned about something new that I wanted to share with anyone, everyone, and that is the, uh, the Pioneer Flag. The Pioneer Flag allows you to attack um, an area around the flag for five stamina instead of 10 stamina, which means that you can attack if you're full on stamina, you can attack 80 times instead of 40 times, thus increasing the amount of honor that you will gain from these territory attacks. Very cool. Uh, I'll show you how to do one in just a second. And, and we're kind of all taking part of this. So this is a, a team effort here. So as you can see, I am now going to attack the tile. I'm not going to take the tile. I'm just attacking it. And that's because my territories are full in my state. Uh, so here's how you do it. Uh, you want to have one person in the alliance who is set up top red, and they are going to take the pioneer banner. It takes something like 47 uh, uh, specialization points in order to get there. So you want to place banner the last 30 minutes. It's going to uh, give you 10% stamina uh, decrease uh, if you just have one out of five of those ticks. If you have all five ticks, it's going to give you 50% uh, stamina decrease, which is five stamina instead of 10. So that means that each person, each time you attack, you attack with five stamina instead of 10, thus giving you the 80 points or 80 uh, attacks. Very, very cool. Um, the rest of the team who is doing this is going to be re-specialized right green and top green, both of which give you extra territory honor gain from your from your attacks. So you get 9% territory honor gain for each of the uh, three out of three ticks that you do. Uh, so that means that you are going to be getting all that extra honor every single time that you attack uh, with the uh, around the pioneer banner. Normally I'd be left green and a lot of people will remain left green, uh, but I finished upgrading all my buildings this week and I am kind of finished uh, with that portion of rock. So this is a good uh, uh, exercise for me. Uh, as you can see, I have 90% honor gain from territory battles. I'm also getting some hero EXP from hit to my attacks. You also want to make sure that you have your honor increase uh, uh, turned on. This gives you, you know, the 100% honor for 30 minutes. Make sure they have that turned on too. That way you get that all that extra honor for every single time you attack. Now, you notice that I'm showing territory capacity. That's because I am actually full on tiles and you wanna be full on tiles in order to do this. If you attack and you're not full on tiles, you'll actually end up taking the tile, which is not gonna be good because you will then spend a lot of time um, kind of letting the tile go, abandoning the tile, and the flag only lasts for 30 minutes. So you want to be full on tiles in order to do this. Fun fact, I actually didn't know that you could take tiles when you were full, or not take tiles, but attack tiles when you're full. Um, so I I um, have played three seasons during Last Shelter, and I've played two seasons during Rise of Empire of Rock, and I just learned this like two weeks ago that you could attack a tile and not take it. So um, very exciting news for me. I assume everyone else knows that. Um, I was just kind of a little bit behind, but that's that's okay. Here you can see how much I've actually gained when I attack uh, a tile. I'm getting about 39,000 um, honor each time I attack. So that means that I, um, you know, if I'm hitting 80 times, I'm gaining about 3 million honor each day that I'm doing this. Probably won't go to level 54, but I'll get pretty close, um, which will set me up nicely for uh, season three of rock. So pretty exciting stuff. As again, you're going to hit the tile, you're going to hit proceed, which is on the far right. And then you're going to just attack the tile, not take the tile. And that is going to be kind of how you are doing this. You want to do it within 30 minutes. Um, as soon as you finish, you're kind of done. And then you wait for the next day, 24 hour cooldown, and you start over. Um, you can see all the people that are participating with uh, with me here. Uh, we've got a few. We'll have more tomorrow um, as people kind of learn about how to do this and, and, and take part as well. So look forward to it and uh, let me know if you have any questions. Drop a comment, drop a question in the bottom of the video. Thank you. Bye.